Hello YouTube, in this video I am going to show you how to install MIUI ROM on your Samsung Galaxy S3 i9300. This is the XDA link for that ROM. You will get this link from the video description below. Just go and check it out. In this page, first go and download the MIUI ROM. There are two different types of MIUI ROM. One is CM based and the other one is SLIM based. You can download any of them. I am using this SLIM based ROM. MIUI ROM. Uh, you have to download that one and then you have to download G apps as well as Buffalo kernel for MIUI version. As you can see, I already downloaded those files here. Yeah. So, next I am going to copy these files to my S3. So, here you can see those files I copied. Now, I am going to restart my system to recovery mode. I am using TWRP recovery mode. If you didn't flash TWRP, there is a link in the video description to show you how to install TWRP recovery. To get enter into recovery mode, you have to press volume up, home button and power button at the same time. Press and hold it until this low look comes, then leave it. So here you can see it's loaded into TWRP recovery. I'm using the version 2.8. Here, first go and take an Android backup of your current ROM. If something goes wrong, you can restore it later. Next, go and wipe Dalvik. Go and wipe your factory reset. So that is also done. Go back, then go to installation option. From there, you have to browse your download file that I stored in ROMs folder. This is the slim ROM. Just go and select it. Then swipe. So you can see it started installation. And you can see the progress bar here. Okay, so the installation is completed. Just go home and then install option again. Now select the G apps, which is Google Apps. Swipe it again. So the G apps installation is also done. Go home and then install. Now choose this buffer lag kernel which because the ROM recommends the buffer lag kernel so you better flash that one. So that is also done. So now go and reboot the system. So here you can see it start showing the boot animation. Remember that the first reboot will take some time because it has to create that Dalvik cache. So here you can see it started loading. The loading is completed. If your ROM didn't open for the first time, you better go back and do the installation again and then come back. It will work. So first select a language. Next. And then if you have uh, other settings, you can set that. I will set it later. If you have a uh, MIUI account, you can do that also. Here, if you are using any data, mobile data plans, you can set it there. And then if you want to enable your data, you can do that also. So this is the local ex location access, like GPS access. Just agree with it. So now you can see it's loaded into a new ROM, which is pretty new. This is called MIUI ROM. You go to the settings, general, about phone. You can find MIUI ROM, based on 4.4.2, MIUI ROM 4.8, 1.3. That's it. If you want to see the review of this ROM, go and check out the link in the video description. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.